Hello, hello, hello. My name is Hector. Welcome back to Sky Adventures. Last episode, we did the rainbow generator. We got the rainbow stone. It is right there. And this... Oh, is this still working? Uh, it shouldn't be. Why is it still working? <laughs> Why is it doing stuff? Everything is on, but also not on. I'm so confused. Or is it just... Is it technically off? I don't know. I don't understand. That is off. So, um, someone also mentioned I um, the reason why I probably needed as much uh, grid power is because I, in the resonator I'd left these in the upgrade speeds, um, or the speed upgrades. That would be better, better English. <laughs> Uh, which I, I'd sort of forgotten about, actually. But, yeah, you get big power penalties for that. So, there you go. That is probably why we got that. Anyway, if we look, if we now look at our quest line uh, for the tech tree, we only need two more things. We need the chaotic fusion crafting injector and the energy uh, ender energy manipulator. So, uh, if we look at the ender energy uh, manipulator, this is actually not that bad at all. Uh, we need just Eyes of Ender, a Wyvern Core, and Draconic Core with a Skull. The only thing is you need 10 Wyvern uh, Injectors, and I've only got, I think, 9. And uh, this one I left on Basic, so I need to make another one of those. That is pretty simple. That is pretty simple, so we will get to that. Now, the Chaotic Fusion thing is going to be harder. So if you look at that, you need to make a Draconic Fusion Crafting Injector in a Draconic, six Draconics, okay? So already I need to make a couple more, uh, well, uh, probably three more, because then then I need one of these as well. So I need three Draconic Fusion in, in Crafting Injectors, fine, all good, we can do that. And then we need a Chaotic Core uh, and a Dragon Egg. So Dragon Egg, obviously, EMC'd, fine. Chaotic Core, however... You need um, four Awakened Core and four Dr Awakened Draconium Ingots. Okay, fine. But then you need the Chaos Shard. And the Chaos Shard is is a pain. Or at least it usually is a pain. So usually you have to go to the Chaos Islands in the end and fight the Chaos Guardian, which is a huge fight and it's a bit of a pain. Then you can get yourself one of these. But, 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 you can see it's also made up of tiny Chaos Fragments. So... If we look at this again, the Chaos Core, uh, nine large make one uh, one Chaos Shard, nine small make one large, and then nine tiny make a small. And if we look in here uh, at the things that you can buy, there you go, you get a tiny Chaos Fragment for $100, which I believe means that 729 of these will make a Chaos like an actual chaos shard, which means that we need seven, uh, we need seventy-two thousand nine hundred or something. Um, hang on, we need yeah, I think I think about seventy-two thousand, uh, well seventy-three thousand of, of the dollar reduce. Now, if we look here, we've got over ten thousand enzymes. This will net us about two hundred and fifty thousand of the monies. So. What I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and set up a an auto clicker, basically. Oh, is it doing the night? Yes, it is. Let's move over here so it's. Oh no! Apparently, we can still hear it over here. It's a bit. It's a bit irritating the sound effect. Maybe I don't know if we can use a muffler. Have we got a muffler? That would be. That would be nice. Yeah, there is one. I don't know if this will work on the uh, celestial whatever it, it is, but we can. We can maybe put it there and find out. Um, so what I want to do is I'm going to use the auto clicker again. So I was using it a while back to process the enzymes because what you don't want to be doing is you don't want to have to basically keep doing that and then clicking on that and then getting the rewards. That is like a big process. But what we also don't want, what we also don't want is uh, our our system, you know, to basically. I, I I want to be able to do all of this uh, as in like a one-y. So I don't want to have to keep like doing that and then getting, you know, setting the auto clicker up again. So what I want, I hope this is making sense. Oh, really though? Oh, so the, the, the muffler does not work. And is it skipping the daytime or is it? I don't know. I think it might have got confused now. 
which is annoying. That is annoying. I don't know why it's wanting to rain, but what I want to do, let's ignore all of that. I think if we can make, there's a player interface, ah, a player chest, yes. Um, a player chest, let's see if we can just make it. What are we missing? More stone burnt stuff and an ender chest. We can make an ender chest, ender chest. There we go, and is stone burnt stuff EMC? I don't think it is, no, but uh, polished stone is, okay. Polished stone, there we go. Let's just do this quickly. And basically, what this does, it, it mimics the player's inventory. So, there you go, that should be... It's, you know what, for having 16 speed upgrades in there, I don't think that that's hugely fast, but there you go. Uh, whatever, that's fine. We've got enough stuff. It, it, so it, this mimics the, the player's inventory, uh, which is what we can use. And there we go, like this. So we put it down, and you can see now it now uses that. So what we can do if we make ourselves like an item conduit, uh, conduit, yes, excellent. Um, what we can do is basically like pipe stuff into this. So actually, if we use a chest, I'll just show you an example. Uh, there we go, like that, and then we put that in the middle. Uh, insert and set that to extract. There we go. So what I will do is let's. There you go. Full access extract insert only. So that is your your basically your options. So what we can do now, say for instance is if we put pop this in here there you go look it ends up being in our inventory very nice very very nice and that just works wherever so what we can do basically is i'm going to pipe these enzymes out of here uh, and put it in my inventory in order to uh, in order to process with the auto clicker and get the money then what we need to do is remove the $20 bills and $5 bills from my inventory from my inventory and uh, put them somewhere else basically store them somewhere else with the wallet so I'm guessing I'm probably just going to put it straight into the system I reckon I think that'll be the easiest thing to do uh, so I need to set up a, a little a little system for that so that's what I'm going to be spending my time doing uh, and hopefully it will work I have one player chest here as you can see doing stuff so insert only okay so this basically I can only it that only inserts right to there so if I like if I take that out I will get or I should get there you go I'll get I'll get more <laughs> that just keeps happening Okay, I, I literally cannot get rid, I cannot get rid of those enzymes, but fine, let's just dump them into the system, there we go. Uh, so we've got that, so that will basically keep these enzymes here. And then, then what I have is another player chest with extract only, okay, so here with an importer that's set to whitelist uh, with a $20 bill and a $5 bill with stack and speed upgrades. So basically what should happen is, uh, and I don't know if I can do it like this. Yeah, I can. So it's really weird doing it like that, that you see like immediate things. So if I put them in any of these slots, obviously these, I should get sucked into the system. There you go, immediately. So I'm going to try and do uh, the auto clicker. So what we need to see is I'm going to come over here and do it. I need to be on here and I need to be on that basically. That's how this works. And if you don't know how to use an auto clicker, there's several ways, but basically it remembers you have to program it to do uh, mouse positions. So what I've done is basically uh, set it to click here. Then it clicks there and then it clicks there and then it will click there again. Basically just it repeats itself. So right now I've just set it to do uh, 50 times. So we're going to see if this works. Ah, so I've obviously I've spotted an issue there uh, in that it is, it is working. That was keeping up. Uh, completely look at that. I've got 50 of those things, right? So let's try that again. And I've even got I've even got, there we go, two more. What I should do, what I should do is, 
let's let's shove that in uh, let's just get things that just block those aha that is the thing that we should do there we go so that kept up it seems that definitely kept up so click on that and let's try this again there we go so you, you can see basically nothing happening now and let's see and there we go look at that and that that has done it that has totally done it uh, and we should be now, if we look in our thingy, I don't actually know what, what is money listed as. I, do, I don't even know. Where are you? Ah, 100. So the good old currency mod. So of course it is. There you go. We've got $120 bills and uh, $105 bills, which is grand. So then we need, obviously, I'll need to... Once I've got all of this in here, I basically what I need to do is cr craft it into like hundred dollar bills. I'm guessing so that we can actually have this in our inventory, basically. But we're we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. So now I'm gonna make a lot of money. That's what I'm gonna be doing. So I'm doing a lot of random stuff here. I need to put, no whitelist. There we go. Let's put you on there like that. Let's put that there and you there. <laughs> not you there uh, and I don't know if this is going to be sped up but let's see if that is actually doing stuff uh, good no good good uh, and it is not yet okay why are you not doing the things that I want so I've got this being made here as you can see and that's set to whitelist but it's not picking stuff up from here and I don't know why. So this is this is an interface import. So I've got in here the pattern to make a fifty dollar bill, as you can see. Uh, and this is making stuff. And I believe that you, yeah, you can set this to any any amount of item. There you go, like that. And that will then make it. And if I take this out, it will just replace it. But I don't know why the the importer then isn't able to take it out of there. Because this is the other thing that I need to do, and that just means that I don't have to craft all of the $100 bills myself. So the next bit that I would do is make this, basically, like that. Uh, put this somewhere that needs to be put. Have I got <laughs> any space? Uh, oh, that is that. I have no space. Look at that. I have no space. Uh, let's get another crafter, then. Crafter. Uh, where are you? There you are. Boom. Let's put you down here. There we go. All of that just for you. Uh, a stack upgrade. Can we do that? No, but a speed upgrade. I'm guessing we can. So let's add some speed upgrades. Speed. One, two, three, four. I'm guessing then. Bam. Lovely stuff. So we could we could potentially now. Well. If when when I figure out how to do it, let's do one of those. There we go. Bam. Let's do this as well. So let's put this in here as well. There we go. So that is making that. Yeah, excellent. Uh, and let's do that as well. So I'm thinking that that should, if it doesn't have enough fifty dollar bills, it should like get it from here maybe. This looks like it is working. I just need to now understand how to then pull these into the system. I find it strange that that just doesn't work like that. And um, this is, yeah, this is coming in. What can I, could I maybe then do it the old fashioned way with some item duct and uh, duct. There we go. Let's shove you back in. And then a servo. No, I probably need more item duct. Come on, Hector. Let's get some more. There we go. And servo. Where are you? There we go. Like that. And basically just pipe you into that chest. Is this going to work? So like that. And then we put you here like that. Uh, put whitelist on. And then just do that. Is that... That is totally doing stuff. 
So that's done that, but then, ah, there you go. There we go. So that is happening now. Is Has this stopped, or do I also need to put a $50 bill in? I imagine I might. I might need to. Good. Uh, so, yeah, I've got no more $50 bills. So what we should do then is maybe do that as well. Um, there we go. So it should now... Yeah, there you go. It should now basically update this. So if we put all of this in, let's have a look. Good. Uh, so I'm getting... Ah, is this just recycling this rather than crafting it? Because if it's doing that, then this is going wrong. <laughs> I think it is. I think it's literally just cycling through that, so this is clearly just not working. Because if I look here and do that, good, and uh, it's like it's never here. So I think it's th those things are just cycling through, which means this is not working. Great. So I just ended up doing the auto clicker a few thousand times, and look at this. I've got ninety three thousand, which is not not too bad. Not too. Oh, is it? Is it? Yes, yeah, man, it's really hard without a comma, yeah, 90, 93,000, which is pretty good, that's like, look at the amount of stacks, and let's go over here, I've not actually checked how much of the enzyme we have left, I can't actually tell like that, uh, we, <laughs> we still have 67,000 enzymes, so that's not too bad, so in the end, I basically just gave up on this, because this basically just seemed to recycle, so every time it wanted one, it would just pick up the one, and I, I could not figure out, without making another storage system to place stuff in, I just couldn't figure out how to do it easily. So um, what I'm going to do, actually now, let's go over here, and let's just turn this off, and then let's put all that back, there we go. That is very nice. So now, what I need to do uh, is, let's also actually because you are annoying, thank you, there we go, is I need to, I need to buy, I need to buy uh, a lot of these things, so, like that, uh, am I, am I buying the, oh, ah, no, of course I'm not, I need, I need the actual monies, don't I, so let's do, let's do a bit of this, and maybe I need another auto clicker system for this because uh, let's see how it works. It's been a while since I've done this. So I'm guessing, yeah, I need to do that, don't I? Yeah, that is that is quite a while. And then actually let's make, let's get that three. Let's make a four, five, six, seven, eight. And nine, there we go, and that should, that should of course make one of these, there we go, so that's what I'm going to do basically, and let's get the rest of this in, uh, another little, another little auto clicker just to make that, so that I get, uh, I think it's 729, I think, if I've done maths right, it is about that, I'm fully prepared for this to be wrong though, and for me to have got the wrong maths. So we shall see. Look at this, look at this. Boom, we have a chaos shard. So I was basically right with my uh, with my maths, which is crazy. I still got like $20,000 dues left, which is grand. So, so now I need, uh, if we look at the injectors, let's look at the injectors. Uh, hey, uh, uh, injector. There we go. So I need uh, one more of these, basically. So I need to turn a basic one into one of these. That's fine. That's easily done. And then I need, I think I said three more of these, which is also fairly easy to do. So that's what I'm going to work on now is just getting all of these. And then, and then we can actually get go ahead and start making this. So I yo ah, so I need to make four of these as well. Okay, that's all doable. That's all very doable. All of that is EMC done. Done. I'm gonna craft all of this stuff up, and then we're gonna have a, a chaos crafting in uh, chaos no chaotic fusion crafting injector. Which let me tell you, this is the first time that I've ever done that ever because I've never really been bothered with the whole chaotic tier stuff. So 
And that's gonna be exciting. Right, so I've been upgrading everything. Uh, as you can see, we've got now eight draconic fusions, uh, and I've got one spare, and then a wyvern one in the middle. So, to get the chaotic core, we need four and one, two, three, four. Okay, and then that needs to go there. Uh, so, what did I say? Four of these, and then four of these. Like that. And these all need to be on the uh, draconic ones. So the ones that I've got around the side, that should do that. Yes! Look at that! That is totally doing a thing. And this is... This is slow. I wonder how much power it's taking. Uh, yes, look at that. It's taking... Oh, wow. It's taking a lot of power. That is taking a lot of power. Might even... Oh, no. No, there you go. Look at that. We're, we're okay. We're totally okay with that power. It's... Yeah, it's sucked up a lot. There we go. That is now done. And that should basically be filling up again. Uh, slowly but surely. Yeah, it is. It's fine. We good. We good. And there we go. We got... We got Chaotic Core. Excellent. So now we need uh, this. So it's four diamonds and then an egg and a thing. And that all needs to be on Draconic as well. So um, that, that, and then four diamonds. Look at that. That's not too bad, you know. That is not too bad. So let's put that there. And then one, two, three, four. And I'm guessing that. Yes, look at that. Oh, wow, that was fast. That was super fast. And whilst we're doing that, whilst this is happening, Ender Energy. Energy. Nope. There we go. We got it. We got it. Energy. Right, what do I need? Uh, one, two, three. Hang on. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, so seven and then two normal cores and a wyvern core. Okay. There we go, we've got this one, we've got this one, let's immediately, immediately, uh, nope, where are we, there we go, immediately do that, boom, $100 bill, uh, and we can put this one here, like that, uh, and we needed one of these, I believe, so that can go on there, uh, and then what was it, seven of these, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, wow, that is a lot of Eyes of Ender, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then I think it was two of these, wasn't it? And then that's it, by the looks of it, and I need a Wither Skull. Let's go grab one, uh, Skull, uh, there we go, bam, and that should be it, that should be it, folks. Huh. Done, yeah, that is happening, look at that. So the annoying thing for this is that you need basically 10, 10 ink crafting injectors. But that, look at that. I don't want to make another one of those, but uh, it is it is totally worth having it now. Oh yeah. Come on. There we go. Ender Energy Manipulator. I don't even know what that is used for, but boom. Look at that. We've got, we've got... We've got this all done, so we've only got the magic tree and bees left to complete. We are getting there, folks. We are getting there. That is exciting. So thank you so much for watching, and that's going to be all for this episode. If you enjoyed it, like or comment is appreciated, as is subscribing to the channel. We're so close, so close to finishing this. I am excited. I've been Hector. This has been Sky Adventures. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.